Welcome back to the channel guys, Rukia here, and I'm bringing you a video on Buzzwool. Like I said in the last video, I'm going to be going over all the Ultra Beasts because they got moved to their exclusive moves. And Buzzwool. This is my favorite of the Ultra Beasts. It is so overpowered. Uh, specifically with this set that I'm showing right now, because I'm getting right to this video. Assault Vest, Max Special Defense, Max Attack, Adamant Nature. This thing does not die. Unless it takes a powerful enough super effective hit, it is not going to die. With the Assault Vest, it gains 100, 100 more points in its special, in special defense. It becomes on par with its um, physical defense. So 300 in both defenses, 355 in HP, and it still has that massive attack points. So, you are going to be, um, with this set you're going to be limited to your offensive moves, but that's perfect fine. Because, this is UV Absorption. You're supposed to run it this way. Leech Life. And, with the move tutor, it gains access to Drain Punch as well. You have two options for healing! Two! And you can use whichever one is more necessary depending on the situation. You also have Earthquake and Ice Punch for the coverage. This thing is busted. It will never, ever, ever die. Unless you get hit with a powerful enough super effective hit. But of course, you can have Pokemon supporting it and switching in on those type of things to get it out of the way. So Buzzable can still reign supreme. This thing can sweep. I've swept teams with this Buzzwool. Ah! <sighs> Sorry. Moving on to the next set. I'm done screaming. Alright. Now... Before Sun, before Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, this is the set that I ran. Except it was Mad at Me Nature. But for this set, I'd say Jolly Nature, Max Speed, Max Attack, and use the Fight MZ. The reason why is because it just helps you like get your um, Beast Boost going with that one super heavy nuke. And from then on, you gain from this you'll gain attack. And you won't sacrifice to anything from the superpower that you're using to use as the Fighting Z. So you use the all-out pummeling. Your moveset's going to be Fell Stinger, Superpower, Earthquake, and Ice Punch. Um, yeah. The reason why Fell Stinger is here because, is because if you get that KO with Fell Stinger, you immediately gain plus four to your attack. Plus four. And it's more likely to do that after you get the Fighting Z. So by the time you take out two Pokemon... You're going to be at plus 5 attack. So whatever comes in after that, you win. It's like, you get the setup going, you instantly win. That's just the power that Buzzwool has. Alright, next set. This is going to be a fully defensive... Well, this is going to be your um, physical, full physical Pokemon. So the idea for this one is Adam and Nature, Max um, Defense... 128 in the attack and 128 in the HP. This is going to be a physical tank, um, physical attacker. The idea here is bulk up, and you use lunge to weaken the um, physical attackers that are trying to hurt you but are already not doing a lot of damage. You're going to weaken them a little more, and you have drain punch for the sustain. And you have ice punch for the coverage. So, yeah. Moving on to the next set. Another full physical set, kind of. So the idea here is, um, let's see, careful nature, max out the special defense, and put 242 points in our HP, and the last few points in our attack, that way we're sure that our attack is getting boosted. So our moveset's going to be Leech Life, Drain Punch, Bulk Up, and Ice Punch. So a lot of these sets are sustain powering up, and just mowing down the opponent, because that's how Buzzle works. Now look at this thing. It looks like a Pokemon that's going to lift you up and throw you to the ground, and that's something Buzzle can easily, easily do. And at the same time, it looks like a Pokemon that's going to suck the, suck the blood out of you. It's a mosquito, so of course it's going to do that. That's why Leech Life, Drain Punch, this is an overpowered combination. Having this much sustain on one Pokemon, it's never going to die. That's why Buzzwool is so overpowered. It is one of the, it's like, in my opinion, it's the best Ultra Beast. Next to Kartana. That's the only thing, that's the only Ultra Beast, in my opinion, that actually 
rivals with um, Buzzwall. <sighs> I ran out of breath there. Sorry, I'm still... Buzzwall gets me hype. So, before I run out of breath, I'm going to end this video. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.